In this video, we'll talk about some of the file handling options that are available from the Trimble Connect panel. We'll start by tapping the Trimble Connect icon. From the Trimble Connect panel, the SketchUp Viewer app will automatically put you into whatever region you were most recently active in in Connect. So if you don't see the project you're looking for, you can tap the Regions icon and choose from a different region, see if your project is in there. From here, you have the option to browse through any of the projects or project folders that you have stored in Connect. The SketchUp Viewer app will automatically filter for SketchUp models that are available in any of those projects or folders. If you land in a project or folder where you have a lot of content, you can scroll through that content using the up or down arrows that are off to the side of the panel. And just like in recent models, the content that's available in Connect, you can view either in a list view or in a thumbnail view. When in Connect, you also have the option to open the overflow card for any of the models that are stored in Connect. And from there, you'll see options for things you can do with those files, like mark them as being available for offline viewing. That'll download a copy and keep the copy of that model saved locally on the device so you, that you can take your device out with you to the field and not have to worry about whether or not you're online. You also have the option to simply download a copy of the file, which can be useful for many of the same reasons. Anything that you do to files that are stored and connect, whether you download a copy, make them available offline, or open them and close them, that will make it so that when you return back to the Recent Models tab, whichever file you've most recently interacted with will automatically show up in the Recent Files list at the beginning of the list.